Hello everyone, this is gonna be a short video just to tell you how to export, uh, especially on spreadsheets like Excel, uh, some uh, tables, uh, SQLite tables, uh, with the software MySQLite Manager for Firefox. So basically it's related to the, to the previous video. Let's open our table. Our table is just, uh, let me just find it. Uh, mm, yeah here okay so this is the table and the same that we saw before so you have many ways to export the data for instance look at this one for instance uh, we, we imagine that you want to okay you want to export this table on on Excel for instance uh, to do it you can do it in, uh, in many ways so for instance uh, you can right click here and then you just write export a table. And then you have a export wizard which opens here. And he is just asking you uh, which table you want to export. So this is real. We want to export this co code category table. But if you want another one, you even can choose another one from here. After uh, here, you've got uh, some uh, export, export formats. So basically, we can choose uh, this one. So S, S, uh, CSV, I think we say like this in English, and you can also export a SQL uh, databases. It's very useful if after you want to import it on other uh, stuff like uh, MySQL and, and so on. And you can also use the XML format, which is a very nice markup language. So basically, uh, we will just cover this one on this video because we'll just see how to, to, to manage the stuff to to, to, to have the information on Excel. I guess, you know, if you use those stuff, you, you are already good uh, about computing and just do it by yourself, just try it and this uh, may work like this. So, how to export uh, the table? It's very easy. First, you just need to, to choose uh, one of those options. So for Excel, I will just, uh, I just go for, for this one, the semicolon. Uh, so you just go to semicolon and then you just uh, click this one. So you just let it like this. You use this configuration. And after that, uh, you can just press OK. And then you can save it somewhere. So let's save it here. Uh, this will be called cold category dot, uh, CSV. Okay, I will save it. Okay, I've saved it. You can see a 29 record exported. If I'm going to here, I still see that it's working here and I can click two times and then you can see that everything has been uh, exported in Excel. So this is working like this. And uh, you can do it also on a other way. For instance, uh, let's suppose that you do a query so yeah, let's suppose that we did this one, this query, and we want to export only the query. So how to do it? We just need to select everything. So you can just press on uh, how to manage this. No. Yeah, I guess you press on the first one and you maintain shift and control on your keyboard. And then you press on the end key, on the end key of your, so once again, I think I will explain again. I didn't explain it good enough. You should know how to do. So you just select the first line and then you maintain the 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 shift and the control uh, key on your keyboard and then you maintain it. And after you press on the end uh, key on your keyboard, so the end key, and then everything will be selected like this. And then you can uh, release every key on your keyboard. And then you just right, do a right click with your mouse. And then you have this nice option, which is called copy uh, this one. So I will just try it like this. So copy uh, for MS Excel compatible. So after I will just need to open a folder on Excel and just pasting. Uh, and this, you can see that this is nice working. So uh, you can see that I've got everything exported uh, into Excel. So you can see that I've got all the columns well organized. So this is a nice way to, to export. Uh, I just got the other option here. You can export as SQL. So I will just open a small text editor. Uh, 
just a second. I will just open, uh, let's say I will open my sublime text. Okay, so I will just uh, do like this. Maybe changing, uh, changing to SQL. So here you can see that I've got my SQL uh, custom query exploitation. So you really see that this is a real uh, SQL uh, files uh, that is very uh, organized, uh, insert into, etc., etc. So you have two way of exploitation, or even three with the XML. So I just let you try this one. Uh, thanks a lot for having watched this video. Thank you.